Bahaya. Welcome to yet again another vlog of mine. I have actually been opening up a lot of vlogs in the last like two weeks and then I open up the vlogs and I vlog for literally about five minutes and then I put the vlog down and then don't pick it up for the rest of the day. So now I'm having to open a new vlog like every day just because I'm not vlogging consistently. But I'm going to try and vlog today. Today is actually Halloween. I really thought we were going to get in more autumn content um, before we started off with like the wintry Christmassy stuff. Which to be honest I'm not going to start on the Christmassy stuff just yet because uh, yeah I am still not over autumn yet. But today's plan is the kids are still on their half term. Today is Halloween. I have just finished doing my makeup on TikTok Live. And I'm about to get ready. And then me and the kids are going to head out. I am thinking to head to a few shops. I just literally want to pop into a Primark. And then after popping into a Primark, just possible like Zara, have a look at a few things. And then take the kids to eat and then come home um, to start doing some Halloween bits. So I thought I will just quickly open up the vlog because it's important to open up the vlogs. You guys can hear the kids downstairs. So I'm trying to quickly put my clothes on now and leave the house before it's hard to get the kids out and it's lunchtime. Hi vlog. Hi vlog. Hi vlog. Hi. So, hi. hi. P.S. Once we get out of the car, I'll show you guys how cute the kids look. I love their outfits today. But we have finally arrived at our destination. But we have finally arrived at our location and we are about to get out of the car now and head into the shops. I think the first place I'm going to go into is Primark and just have a look at a couple of things. I don't need anything from Primark. I literally just want uh, the two more shades of the pyjamas, which I um like absolutely love so i just want two of those but yeah let's get out the car so i can show you guys the kids and so this is the kids outfit i love ubby's because she's wearing this really cute little leather jacket and then half is just there right in the back. yeah let's go guys yeah. so we are now gonna head to the shops and i think we might just go for a quick lunch as well just the three of us depending but there is quite a lot of stuff like close by so there's a TK Maxx as well uh, which probably has some Christmas stuff out and then they've also got a Starbucks they've got a Matalan they've got a few things so I might just head to those after we finish from the shopping centre so we'll just have a little think about it and see what else there is so we've popped into a shop called Lakeland and they have so many cute like Christmassy bits out already. Look at these. Look, look. Oh, these are LED Baby candles trees. as well. Baby trees. Baby trees. Look at them. What are they? LED Tree candle tea lights. Can I, can I see? Well, they're actual real ones that you can actually light. Look how cute this is, guys. Just as a little decoration for Christmas. Yeah. Oh, what are they? don't know <laughs> so we have just popped into Primark now and let me show you guys because this Primark is really good look at these like look at this beautiful jacket it's just such a clean Primark for once and they've just got lots of nice stuff the viral pajamas I keep telling you guys about are these ones here this is the velvet PJs which I just keep talking about and then this is the other color I've got so I've got the ones in this color and the ones in this color but I specifically came here to find this color because I wanted these in all of the colors so they've actually got it in this color this is the matching set and you wouldn't believe it look they've actually got the matching robe as well I probably won't buy the robe just because the PJs are full sleeve but if you do want the robe They've actually got the matching robes here as well. Look, so guys, I've actually got this colour here. And the only colour I ever saw was black. But look at this beautiful beige colour. Oh, wow. Look at this beautiful beigey colour. Abby, what did you buy? Abby has, we'll show it at home, but Abby has actually got a little money box. We've just come back from Primark and we've just been to a few shops. Come here, darling. And our Primark bag is so huge, guys. Like, 
I wasn't meant to spend more money at Primark again seeing as we just went there but we just took a very quick short break so now we are going to leave and let's go come on kids and we're gonna go see a few things yeah so yeah we'll get some so we're gonna actually pop into Zara now I've been after this gilet for really long a long time so I'm gonna pop in there see whether it's worth it or not whether I should get it or not so I'm gonna pop in there now let's have a look and see we are in H&M home look at all of their Christmassy bits that they have got so nice it's just Abby. H&M yeah H&M home and then Abby off you get Abby's on the little we do have lots of like food bits for their kitchen here like for their Christmas tree yeah they have like wine ones and loads of things but they're like six pounds and I don't know if I can justify the six pound I'm spending on them so I'm thinking to maybe see at a few more shops and then come back to this one Just try decorating it with a pot now can I decorate it with you yeah let's come to Liguana's now to have some quick lunch I was like we can just go home and eat but then Harvey really wanted something and I thought why not since we are um, on a little spree probably might not hit B&M now because I'm like maybe I might just give that a miss just say think maybe the kids might get tired or I might you're still do it so you're already so tired he gets tired very quick but I actually picked up a really cute like Diwali Diva from Lush I'm so excited to use it I think it's gonna be so cute like a prep with me for Diwali and I got, and I got a Santa thing where has candy yeah I got a a little pink bubble a fairy one she got a little fairy bath one but anyways guys I'm gonna pick some food now it is pouring down with rain outside it's so wet but oh my god oh my god oh my god yeah. so I have never experienced this before meaning like it's a good experience there is a home bargains like I just drove past a massive home bargains and then I was actually driving to a B&M store and then as I drove past the B&M store there's a massive home bargains literally connected to it I have never seen that like my where we live hi where we live we have one home bargains a tinsy home bargains tinsy. and they have a tinsy mincy home bargains and they have yeah, two tinsy, humongous tinsy, home bargains which are tinsy, nearly situated tinsy, by a main tinsy, road tinsy, but anyways we are going to head into home bargains tinsy, and tinsy, b m now hoping the kids tinsy, are going to be tinsy, on their best tinsy, tinsy and then we're going to have a starbucks tinsy, on our way tinsy, home tinsy, as well but let's get out of the car guys because who's excited Yay. we've just come into the home bargains this is huge compared to the one i always go on to and i feel like i'm gonna get so much stuff in here i'll show you guys like the halloween section even though halloween's practically over is massive so i'm just like wow we are back in the car it's abby is actually fast asleep which i'm not actually surprised about because she is so exhausted b m wasn't too bad um i just bought a couple of cleaning stuff and that was it really b m didn't have anything they actually just had a very small christmas section as well whereas home bargains had such a massive christmas like section but we have actually been out of the house for about five hours now can you guys believe five hours we have literally been out since the morning i was so sure we're going to be home for lunchtime, but clearly not but yeah we are now heading home i wanted to go to the drive through starbucks on my way back home but i missed the like stop to it and i don't really know myself around this area so i was like you know what forget it we're just going to head home did we shop out or did we shop out it doesn't look like a lot because a lot of the stuff is like squashed into each other's bags but we actually bought quite a bit from um home bargain surprisingly and literally nothing not a lot from ho um from b m we have finished obviously doing our pumpkins i actually added a little bit of makeup to my face as well i'm not really sure i like it but i just thought you know what i'm just gonna pop on a bit of black lipstick and why not it's halloween yolo um but look at the kids half and let's look at avi and harvey that is harvey if you mind. 
can't spot. And then we've got Miss Little Miss Witch over here. There he is. It's Harv. I told you guys, don't be scared. Good morning, guys. Good morning. So today is the next day, obviously. Um, but today is the 1st of November. I was like, you know what? Let's just carry on the vlog. Today is a kind of like a cleaning day. Uh, we haven't got any plans today. I am still on um, annual leave until next week. So... I was like, let's do a few of these things today whilst we can. So let me show you guys what I have been doing this morning. I have basically been busy collecting all of the autumn stuff. I know it could be a very early for you guys and you guys are, might just be like, I mean, what are you doing? But we have got the Vali, which is um, literally it is on the 13th. So we've got about nearly two weeks to go until the Vali. So I kind of just thought we could either leave this all until Diwali, but then I kind of felt like when I'm going to start doing my Christmas stuff, it's going to be hard to pack away all of this and then to um, just kind of pack away my, like open up my Christmas stuff. So I thought let's start decluttering and let's start putting everything together. I've pretty much collected all of the autumnal stuff around the kitchen. So I've emptied that area, which is usually my chopping board. I've got my normal everyday chopping board just sitting here. So I'm just gonna pop that back on. Um, yeah, everywhere else, all of my autumnal tea towels are either gone in the wash um, to be washed or they have been put away because again, we're just putting them away. I'm just going to go around the house collecting all of this and then the plan is that we go into the loft and we have a look at all of our Christmas bits. We move our Christmas bits into sections. I don't know if we'll get a chance to do this all today but we're going to try. We're going to see what we can move and how we're going to do everything. So yeah, that is the plan today. Okay, so we have got everything just laid out here. I bought everything in a bag just so I can carry it. It looked like a lot of stuff earlier, but it's actually not a lot of stuff as I thought it was. Like, especially when I did my autumn decor, I thought there was more stuff. I have packed away everything, including wreaths. That reminds me there's a wreath downstairs, but I don't know if we're going to pull that one off just yet or we're going to wait until we put the Christmas one on. Maybe I might leave that one and add it in. We are now going to head into the loft and start organising some of that. I have actually brought myself to TK Maxx first. So I want to pop into Asda because they have a few little Christmassy bits. But I thought first stop will be TK Maxx. We've got a new one which is opened. So let's have a look. It's a little bit small but still we should see a few little Christmassy things. So I thought let's give it a shot and see if we can find any nice Christmas stuff. So let's go. to get cheap Halloween stuff. They've actually got everything reduced down to like a pound, just putting it out there. But if you look here, they've already got some nice little decorations, these felt little trees. And they've got some nice duvet sets as well. I actually really like this because it's beige from like white from one side and then it's got this beautiful green, really nice. It's a brushed cotton. And they've got this checkered one if you're looking for something a little bit more plain. They've still got their Halloween ones. Oh, this is a nice one as well. It's a little reindeer one, actually. And it's just got a very small hint of green if you don't want too much green flashing around. Oh my God, look at me. I look so weird. <laughs> I'll like look at this small head between this chunky gilet. Yes, what is there on my seat that I can't see? But I am currently, where should I pop you guys? This one is too low, I'll pop you guys here. I am currently on my way home. I finished my shop in Asda. I'm not gonna lie, I was very disappointed in Asda. Just because I thought they'll have more Christmassy bits. And I don't like to have like, like they had some nice stuff. Like they had a few gingerbread -y things. But I, I'm just not a fan of like, a casserole dish or a container which is like fully red or something like that even though I did pick up a red um, like pie um, tray which actually I exchanged the red one 
<coughs> for the green one instead but anyways I was yeah I just popped in I got those and I was just not satisfied but I've still left I want to go into next home or maybe Matalan to see a few more Christmassy bits I do have a lot of Christmas tree decorations and things I think I am going to keep my um, Christmas tree in my living room the same color as last year and I'm just going to um, get some new decorations for my current Christmas tree which is um, which I will put into the kitchen but yeah so that is it I like I said want to get a couple of new bits for from like next and Matalan which I will have a look at and I'll have a look at a few things online um, but yeah that is about it I am now heading home I've actually just finished from Argos I popped into Argos to get myself a new pressure cooker because unfortunately my old pressure cooker broke um, so yeah it's not really cooking my dal anymore so I went and got myself a new cooker so I'm gonna see how that one is I'm just annoyed that I had to spend 40 pounds on a new pressure cooker but they do last a very long I had the last one since my wedding which has been amazing so yeah so I have just come into the house and I've opened up my pressure cooker I knew my previous pressure cooker was big like it was big and it was big and I wanted a small one which I can just make enough dal for the three of us but now I'm like thinking is this too small because at the end of the day we're dissy and we often have people come round, especially for like Diwali in a couple of weeks I might be hosting Diwali this is a like a tiny little thing but I'm gonna see I think I'm still gonna keep it because I need to use a dish a pressure cooker today so let's try and use it and let's see. P.S. Let me show you guys a few bits which I picked up as well. I picked up these cute little ginger, um, gingerbread salt and pepper shakers. They had these ones and they had the same ones with candy cane, scarf and hat. I just thought those were a little bit too much. And then I bought this decorative ribbon, not to use, only to decorate. Um, oh wait, you can use it actually. People, you do use this, but I'm only going to have this to like decorate with and then i've kind of realized that we're maybe going for a green theme this year in this kitchen but i ended up getting this beautiful green candle because i bought a couple of like accent green stuff to go in this kitchen so i bought that and then you guys would have seen uh, when I showed you guys in TK Maxx, they actually had a red version to this and then they had a green version. The red version was so nice. It was very festive, but I kind of felt like it was in your face. And then seeing as we're doing like a greeny theme, I picked up this one here just to make a pie or something this like festive season. And then I saw this cutie and they actually match like the trees here are kind of similar to the trees in here. They kind of match, whereas the red ones kind of matched with each other. So I picked up these. And then from Asda, I also picked up a nice little green hand towel. I wanted to see if this hand towel matches all of the accent green stuff which I brought. It does, so I will definitely go back into Asda and pick out another hand towel just to have on kind of display over here. But I do think I'm gonna put these to the side, leave these to the side until I start decorating with Christmas. And the same way we had a autumn deco with me, we'll do a Christmas one, so yeah.